Hello all, thank you for joining in this call. Uh, I'm Hitesh and I'm a PM in the Outlook Add-ins team. And uh, I'll give short updates on some of the uh, UX changes that we're doing for add-ins on the Outlook web. So this is especially applicable to uh, over commercial users uh, for whom the, uh, the add-ins are primarily deployed by their admins. And what happens today is that whenever an admin gives an add-in to the user, the add-in goes uh, into this overflow menu uh, in the Outlook web, uh, which can be accessed from the small three dots uh, that you see, uh, be it reading pane, calendar surface, or compose mode. Uh, all the admin defined, admin installed add-ins uh, go into this uh, overflow here. This leads to some problem where a user has no text or visual clue uh, whether uh, and a new add-in is given to them. And uh, uh, and it's not like uh, users don't have control to pin the add-ins, but the setting uh, to do that is also quite uh, difficult to find. So uh, uh, if you if you know about this setting, it'll, it'll take about uh, four clicks and a scroll for you to go in the Outlook setting and uh, uh, choose the add-in that you want to pin on the ribbon, right? So, uh, so we are making uh, changes to uh, this uh, this approach now, uh, wherein we are bringing some kind of parity to uh, the way uh, the add-ins appear on the Outlook ribbon, right? So, uh, what we are doing is that uh, whenever uh, an admin installs an add-in, uh, be it uh, uh, on any surface, be it calendar, compose, or read mode. The add-ins by default appear on the ribbon surface, and a uh, user will see a one-time uh, nudge uh, on that add-in, informing them uh, that a new add-in has been installed. Right? Uh, this is just a demo of this. So this is uh, a calendar add-in uh, that your admin gave, and uh, the add-in will get pinned on the ribbon, and uh, the user will see a small nudge uh, saying that, hey, this add-in has been given to you by your IT admin. Uh, the user will also have option to customize this uh, customize this ribbon, uh, wherein they can click on this button and uh, it will directly take them to the, the settings for uh, customizing the ribbon, right? Uh, so this will also uh, be applicable to other surfaces. Uh, so this is just a demo for what you saw for the compose mode wherein if the user uh, goes on the compose mode and if there is a new add-in there, uh, uh, the add-in will be pinned on the ribbon and uh, the user will see a nudge uh, on top of that add-in, right? So uh, this change uh, will be uh, will be live uh, soon. Uh, so uh, this will be coming in April, uh, next month that is, uh, for all over commercial users. And we are not stopping here. We will be bringing up uh, more changes to improve the uh, add-in discoverability and accessibility on Outlook Web. So stay tuned. We will be announcing more. And that's all I have. Thanks. Cool. Thank you, Hitesh.